Hi everyone, it's Carlos here. Welcome and welcome back to my channel. All right, you guys, so in today's video, today's video has finally arrived. Well, no, the video didn't arrive, the package arrived. Anyways, you guys, today's video, we are going to be unboxing my BoxyCharm Lux shipment for the month of March, 2022. That is right, the Lux has finally arrived and you know what that means. Mm -hmm. It's going to probably be a hot mess because lately the Lux boxes have been kind of like mediocre. Like seriously, I just feel like the Lux boxes are not as Lux as they used to be like two, two, three years ago. Maybe it's just me, maybe it's Maybelline, I don't know. <laughs> Anyways, you guys, if you wanna know exactly what I received, again, in the BoxyCharm March Lux shipment for 2022, then keep on watching and find out exactly what goodies that we received. But before we get started on that, make sure you hit that subscribe button, also hit the notification bell as well, so anytime I upload new videos, you automatically get the notifications, and, and give my video a thumbs up. Why am I so dramatic? And <laughs> and give my video a thumbs up as well. Why? Because I would truly appreciate that. All right, you guys, so without further ado, and before I start messing up the video as I already am, let's go ahead and start getting, um, in, <laughs> see, I did it. Let's get unboxing. <laughs> All right, you guys, so let's go ahead and get the sucker open because I really wanna know what's in here. Plus, it's actually pretty heavy, so that could be two things. Again, 50-50, it could be horrible, it could be good, just because of the weight. Bum, 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 drum roll, please, what is in our Lux? I know I get to choose maybe like an item or two, but I always forget, I always do. And out of sight, out of mind, I just hurry up and click, and sometimes I don't even get to choose because I forget to actually pick because life takes a hold of us. You get what I'm trying to say, right? So. All right, so let's see exactly what we received. So we got the good old handy trusty card. Again, the card just basically gives you a rundown of all the information. No, it gives you the information of all the products that you received in your variation along with the overall price point and what the products are used for. Typically, it, that's what it's supposed to do. Does it always do that? No, not necessarily. All right, you guys, so let me go ahead and put that to the side. Let's take a look right away. Ooh, okay. I could probably tell already this must be a palette. It's an... I looked at it really quick, quick, quickly, <laughs> really quickly. <gasps> I got a Natasha Denona palette. <gasps> Wait, I think I may have saw this, or is this an exclusive to the company or to BoxyCharm? Anyways, let's save the best for last. At least I hope it's the best. Let's save this for last and come back to that one. So this is from the company. I, I don't know. Let's take a look. So these look right, right here. These look. Never a dull moment with my channel. All right, talk clearly, Carlos. All right, what is, is it on here? All right, let me take a look, cause I don't see it. Is it stay calm? Is it give me, give them la la skin? All right, let's, oh yeah, it is. It's called give them la la skin, stay calm, soothing sheet mask. Oh, okay, so it does say that right here. <laughs> sheet mask. Hello. It has aloe infused, so you may not be able to see it because, again, if I get too close, it gets blurred out. Anyways, you guys. All right. So it looks like you get a total of four face sheet masks. It looks like right here, it looks like it retails for $30. All right. I'm going to be completely honest. I'm not going to open it up just because we already know exactly what sheet mask or face masks look like we already know what exactly how they perform as well you plop them onto your skin they don't always stay in the right spot but pretty much it does hydrate your skin and that is the sole purpose of a face mask i think all right let me go ahead and put that to the side and see exactly what other goodies we received so what is this liquid glass is that the name of the company so miracle soothing sealant Okay, so it says this la lasts through three washes, through something like that. So you spray it in your hair, I'm guessing. All right, so let's take a look at the card right here, because clearly that's why we have it. What is this? Br okay, is it Dry Bar? Is that the name of it? Dry Bar? All right, let's take a look. Oh, yeah, it is. So it looks like this retails, whoa, this retails right here for $34. So basically what it says on the card, it says, meet the ultimate frizz 
Fighter heat activated technology wraps as invisible shield around each hair strand to provide frizz resistance, leaving a super glossy, silky fresh without weighing down the hair. Last to th three washes, protects from heat. Okay, that's pretty cool actually. Now basically it says how to use, use on damp hair for best results. Do not apply on pre-style products. Okay. I meant, they probably meant pre-style hair with using products. Let's take a look. I am curious. Does it have a scent? Ooh, the scent is really nice. All right. So my hair obviously is not like damped, but I just definitely want to spray it in my hair. I just want to feel how like it feels on my hair. Granted, maybe I probably should damp my hair, but it is what it is. I'm not, ow. I'm not looking for like a, an instant like like instant review because it says the last for three three washes through three washes why am i feeling so scatterbrained i just really want to know how it feels through the hair if it's greasy it says it's not but you know sometimes they be lying all right um real quick i absolutely love the scent really quick in the sense of providing you that information now how well it performs we won't know until a little bit later, until I don't wash my hair for it. Well, it didn't say I didn't have to wash my hair, but it did say it lasts up to three washes. All right, you guys, what I want to do later, I'll probably do a separate video, kind of giving you like a heads up, like how it performed. Did it perform? Did it do what it said it was going to do? Did I make any sense? <laughs> This right here is not working. I'm a little special right here. All right, I'm so scatterbrained today. So this is from, oh, white, it always, okay. So maybe from a distance, no, you won't be able to see it. There it is, barely read it, I'm sorry. So this is from the company Complex Couture. Culture, why do I say Couture? Culture, Complex Culture, excuse me. So what is this here? So right away, it does retail for $32. This is a filter out daily blue light defense mist. Oh, I've always wanted to try one of these. Um, I think I had received a similar product, but I gave it away, but I don't think it was a spray. It was more of like a, a serum, but let's take a, oh my God. This is totally up my alley. Like the, the packaging, the layout, the design of it. <gasps> Isn't that gorgeous? It's completely like gray, see-through. I just love it for the bottle right away, I do. All right, let's go ahead and spray this. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I'm not sure how much I'm supposed to spray on my actual face, but it, let's see what else it tells us. It just says, whole bottle six inches away from face, close eyes, miss, um, evenly use anytime you need to hit refresh well, you need to hit a refresh and instantly feel hydrated, uh, rejuvenize and protect it. Oh, that's pretty cool. So you can use this any time of the day. I, again, I love the packaging. I love the bottle of this. All right, so this is from the company Juice Beauty. It is a stem cellular anti-wrinkle overnight serum. Ooh, I have used one of their products before for under the eye area and I absolutely loved it. So let's see how much this retails for. So right here, what? This retails for $72. All right, so I know it's for nighttime, but to be completely honest, how does your skin, how does your skin know when it's night and daytime? Like if any of you guys, this is cute. If any of you guys know how your skin determines when it's nighttime, it's like morning time, midday, let me know because I honestly feel that you can use skincare products that say it's nighttime, morning time, anytime you choose to, to be completely honest. That's how I feel. The reason why I'm applying this is because I want to see how it absorbs into my skin because you, if you guys know and you guys are a returning friend to my channel, you know that, oh my God, I love this scent. Oh, I love this scent. Oh, it smells like lemongrass. Oh my God. Oh, yeah. have you ever smelled lemongrass before? It's to die for. It feels like you're just walking in a field of just like lemongrass and it just completely soothes you. Oh my goodness. I love it. I love this just by the scent alone. But so far, look at this. It absorbed right into my skin right away. That's for me, that's a plus in my book just because I love products that do that. All right, let's go ahead and do this forehead area either. Just be careful with the brows, Carlos, because you just did those not too long ago. You want to keep them looking fresh and tight. <laughs> that kind of sound kind of funny after hearing myself. Anyways, um, yeah, 
But look, no leftover residue. Oh, so we got another um, eye cream here. So this is Ren Clear, wait, Clean Skin Care is Brightening Dark Circle Eye Cream. Green. All right, so this retails for $49. Again, typically these type of products you can use any time of the day. All right, so this looks very um, Walgreen-ish. <laughs> no shade to Walgreens. Do you get what I'm trying to say, right? It's just kind of cheap looking. All right, not to say Walgreens carries cheap products. Let me be nice and neutral about that. All right, so let's go ahead and then pump this sucker out because I'm just curious. I hear, I, I, you know, you're just as curious as I am, but why is there nothing coming out? Hello? Oh, there we go. <laughs> Whoa, that's enough for two eyes. All right, so let's do here. Actually, it has the same color as the last product that I got done using by Juice Beauty. All right, why do I look like I'm ready for football? <laughs> right? Except though, instead of being black, I got. You get what I'm trying to say, right? All right, you guys, let's go ahead. Hey, question. How many of you guys are disappointed that football is over? Like, like Super Bowl is over? Let's be completely honest, too. I think the last couple years, I would say the last four years, I really got into football. Okay, this is actually going into the skin really good. Um, Just because of the players. <laughs> it's no joke. I'm like, I get so entertained as the players, their physique. And I'm like, okay, I'm starting liking this game here. <laughs> Just uh, probably too too much TMI. <laughs> All right, you guys. So, what do you guys think? But so far, if I give you a close up of my skin, you see how well it absorbed. Got some right here. Okay. I again, the reason why I like testing these out right away because if it absorbs into my skin quickly. That's good because I don't like when a product just it feels like it's caked onto your skin and you feel like you can't move like this because what's all this because it feels like it's like this gunkiness on your face. Is it just me or am I just being over analytical and just over analyzing this? Anyways, you guys, so the other product that we received in my box, this is what's it say? Clean AF. Okay, so this is from the company, oh, Lawless, right here, Lawless, this is Forget the Filler Lip Plumply Lime Soothing Gloss. Ooh, I love when I get um, plumping lip products. So it looks like here, this retails for $25. All right, let's take a look. Oh, why is the packaging so nice today? Look at this. It's like a nice, soft, rose baby color oh my god you guys i'm telling you it's gorgeous whoa look at this dough applicator isn't that strange looking or just maybe i'm strange careful there <laughs> anyways no seriously look at this you see this right here so it actually is kind of cool though because it'll like sit on your lips and you go like this ah that's so neat huh i'm just so mesmerized by this applicator here I feel like there's like a flavor to it and also a scent, but hmm. All right, you guys, so hmm. I don't see any difference. Nope, <laughs> why do all that? Okay, now I'm starting to feel like a tingling sensation because a little bit got in my mouth. I'm feeling kind of like that pepper that, you know, because usually they put some of that, like spice into these type of products. Like, pep, like some type of pepper in there. I was supposed to say paprika, I'm not sure why. But the reason why is because that stimulates the blood flow in your lips to kind of boost out them, not boost them out, to make them look bigger than what they are. You get what I'm trying to say? Anyway, so let's go to this product right here. The one that I'm looking at as like very questionable. So this is company Frank Body, I believe. Let's take a look. Uh, yeah, it is Frank Body. It is Perky Sculpty Body hydrator this retails for $19.95 but I'm not gonna lie I see an imprint of like a buttocks and it's very questionable and it even says right here is I'm your dream I I'm your dream coffee with a double shot wait I'm your dream cream <laughs> with a double shot of coffee and it says re coffee uh, a reusable coffee cup what do they mean by that Guess we'll find out. And then on the side, there's some more additional information. It says, my coffee cup is food grade and reusable. Okay, now I'm really curious. And then this tells you the ingredients on this side. Deeply hydrating, helps to reduce the appearance of cellulite through moisture and massage. Caffeinated for perky skin. 
So you just have to apply this on your butt? What kind of bull is... <laughs> no pun intended. Um, so it says, how to use me. Massage in a circular motion all over your body. Oh, okay. It, it, they really had me going here. I'm like, what the? Not today, Satan. Anyways, so daily focus on areas that need extra love, securing the, uh, ensuring to massage in long, deep stroke. All right, let's just open this box because I have no clue where we're going right now. <laughs> All right, you guys, so... This is the container. You cannot see it because obviously the lighting. Let me see if I can get closer. No, shucks. All right, but on the bottle or on this coffee reusable cup, it does say butt first. Kid you not, B-U-T-T. Butt first and then comma coffee period. I don't get the marketing on that. All right, and then on the top, maybe you may, maybe you won't. No, you won't. It's very the same logo drawing that was on there, the buttocks. It's on here too. And then you got the name of the company right here. All right, I'm going to be completely honest. If this is reusable and the product is in here, I don't know how I feel about reusing a product that already had chemicals inside of a reusable cup. Is it just me? I don't know. Even though it's clean product, quote unquote, I'm not sure how I feel about that. Leave a comment below. Let me know if I'm just overthinking this. Is it safe? Would you use this cup again? It's cute, but I probably would use it for something else. Maybe for one of my kids coloring crayons, put them in here down in their playroom. Anyways, you guys. All right. So that is the open. Well, that's how it looks like when I open it. Yeah. Look, you see the product is in there. It's in there. So it doesn't look like you can pull this out yeah i don't know how i would feel about reusing this as a drinking and serving cup all right so let's go ahead oh it smells good it smells like cocoa cocoa butter all right so let's say let's say we go into this clearly they say you can use it for anything so at least that's a good sign all right let's go ahead and apply this on my hand because my hands has been extra dry the past couple of days just because i've been doing things around the house washing dishes all of that you know all of a sudden it just takes away the moisture oh and breaking down boxes i never knew that when you break down boxes like cardboard boxes the cardboard boxes actually soaks up all of the moisture in your hands did you know that because i didn't and no wonder why my hands look like like I've been chewing on them. Um, again, it just smells like cocoa butter. If you're not a person who likes cocoa butter, then you're not gonna like this because it does smell like that really, really strongly. Now, is it powerful? No, absolutely not. But I do like it. It doesn't leave it like greasy whatsoever. So that's good for them. Will I use this? Of course I'm gonna use it, I already did but I just don't know about the actual cup. All right, you guys, so the last and final product that we received, it is the Nat Natasha Denona palette, which is the palette right here, Cupid. All right, let's take a look and see what this looks like. Ooh, for some odd reason, I feel like I have this, but I know I don't. All right, so just being on the safe side, I'm not gonna swatch it, even though I really, really want to, but I'm not going to because I really wanna just hold off to make sure that I don't actually already have it because if I do, I can give it to somebody else. But these are actually really pretty shades. You can't really see it too well in the camera. Hopefully when I'm editing, you'll be able to see it. But this one right here is like a really nice dark mauve and then you go into lighter shades. These two right here are nice metallic shades, so that's really nice. All right, you guys, so let me go ahead and put this away. Again, I'm not gonna swatch it, I apologize. I like testing all of the products so that you guys can see exactly how well it performs. But either way, when you do a swatching anyhow, you don't really get the actual full effect of how well the palette's going to perform until you actually start using it on your eyelids. You get what I'm trying to say. All right, you guys, what do you think about my box that I received? Again, keep in mind, Boxy Charm Lux is completely different in the sense of a premium and a base because the premium and the base you typically get, or you're supposed to, get more of the actual makeup gear products here is more of a lifestyle i'm actually happy with it definitely leave a comment below let me know your guys thoughts and opinions about the products that i received and if you do receive boxycharm lux which items have you received and if you received any of these which ones you liked and which ones you didn't all right you guys if you haven't done so already make sure you hit that subscribe button also hit the notification bell as well so anytime i upload new videos you automatically get the notifications and give my video a thumbs up as well because it really does wait 
it really I really do appreciate it. <laughs> Where am I going with this? Anyways, you guys, until then, make sure you all brush your teeth, wash your culo, and subscribe. I will see you guys in my next video. Take care. Bye now.